Hello everybody, it's Rex here, and today we're taking a look at some new um, Jurassic Legos coming out this year, and um, they're based off of um, the short films by Lego, so that's why the, the sets look how they do. So first up we have this um, set that is pretty cool, it comes with a little tiny Dilophosaurus, it's smaller than the bigger ones, but it does look like its mouth is still articulated, which is cool. Um, it comes with a little gift shop stand, which is nice, along with three little figures which is cool, along with a um, drone. Okay. <laughs> um, a pretty cool little set. Um, and this one will be $20. All right. And we're starting at the lowest and going up to the highest priced out of all these. Um, $20 for this set? Yeah, that's a reasonable price. And I'm kind of interested in this one. I do like it. Um, so this one is pretty cool. Next up we have this set, which is also pretty cool. Um, this one is $30. Yeah, okay. Um, looks pretty nice. Comes with a Jeep, Owen, you know, and other guys. Um, pretty cool. I like it. Comes with a little trailer and that the vehicle can um, pull. Does look pretty cool. Though in this image here, I I don't know about the... Um, uh, wow. Completely slipped my name with dinosaurs. Barry Onyx. Um, why it has raptor claws. I I don't know why. Why it has raptor claws. Um, it's pretty interesting. And yeah, okay. <laughs> um, okay. Maybe it's a hybrid. I don't know. Um, comes with some pretty good selections. And it comes with a dog. Comes with a dog. <laughs> I do like the um, uh, look of the Baryonyx. It looks really cool. I like the Baryonyx look. It looks nice. The paint looks good on it. Um, cool little set. Um, here's an image of it in the box. So you kind of get an idea how it looks there. And next we have the Triceratops set with a little tiny merry-go-round egg. Um, little right there. I do like they're putting in little um, um, park elements into these sets, which is cool. Um, the little one that comes to the Lophosaurus and this one are the only two with that park type look, but... Um, yeah, that does look that does look pretty nice, and the eggs are nicely um, painted to look like Jurassic, like dino eggs instead of white. So that's cool. Um, however, this is going to be a sixty dollar set, and me personally do not think it's a sixty dollar set. It should be thirty dollars, in my opinion. Um, the fence is pretty cool. You know, you can pull it up, and you can knock it down. Is nice, and the merry-go-round thing does twirl, so it does work. Maybe that's why it costs so much, because all that mechanics, you know, has to go into actually making the merry-go-round egg thing work. So maybe that's why it's so expensive. I don't know. Um, so here's an actual um, image of the Triceratops breakout set, I guess. I, that's not its official name, but that's what I'm calling it. Um, eh, looks okay. I mean, like the Triceratops. Do like the Triceratops. Looks nice. But, again, $60, I I don't think it's worth $60. And here's an image of it in the box. Okay, and now we're going to the big, whopping $90 set. Here it is, and um, it comes with a T-Rex, newly painted T-Rex, along with a mech T-Rex, along with a boat, with four little raptors, you know, the whole team of baby raptors that grow up to um, get, you know, eaten well, not eaten, killed and blown up by a guy and the Indo, Indominus Rex. So you can have the baby versions before that happens. Um, I like the little um, built boat it comes with. That's pretty cool. Um, the mech, dinosaur mech, looks... I like it just because it's got the um, the colors of the tour vehicles. You know, it looks like they took the tour vehicles and built this dino mech out of it. Um, I wouldn't call it a T-Rex mech because it has three claws, but if you got rid of the bottom claw there, it would have two claws, and then you could call it a T-Rex mech. But I guess the third claw is there just so we can actually grip something. So, okay. Okay. I do like it. I'm definitely going to have stickers on it. I don't like stickers, but just, just de definitely going to have stickers. Um, and here's another image of the set in more in-hand image. Um, looks pretty cool. Um, here's an image of just the Dino Mech. Um, it's interesting. It's interesting. Um, I do like it. It looks cool. All right. Yeah. I, I mean, I like it. Yeah. This look. It looks interesting. And I, 
looks cool. And um, here is an image of the T-Rex repaint. And I do like the T-Rex here. It looks really cool. Um, I'm glad it's not just giving, the Lego's not just giving us another, you know, standard T-Rex. This one's actually different colored. So, you know, that looks nice. And here is an in-ham, here's the f full image of the entire um, T-Rex set right here. Um, I don't really, again, get the Vulcan. I mean, it is a background piece, but if you, you could have, the set doesn't need the volcano thing there. You could have easily taken out the volcano bid and lowered the price down probably to maybe $80 or something. But $90 for this, it's still a hefty price. I don't really normally show Lego stuff. Actually, I've never shown Lego stuff. Um, I do like Lego, but due to the fact of how expensive Legos are, you know, and it doesn't, I don't really feel like the price is always worth what is shown for that price. Um, but, um, yeah, that is a look at all the upcoming um, sets that will be coming out, most likely during summertime. That's when it's been projected to when these sets are going to come out, you know. Um, so quite a while off, but, um, though I really wish they were Jurassic Park sets, you know, Jurassic Park, The Lost World, Jurassic Park 3 sets, that's what, that's just me, but, you know, you can let me know your thoughts on all of these new Lego sets coming out, are you interested, you can pick them up, I might pick up the small one, this $20 is pretty reasonable, I think, um, but yeah, that's been a look at the new Lego sets, and, um, they all look pretty cool, but again, price, Ooh, that, those prices. <laughs> all right, so I'll see you all in the next video. Until then, have a great day, and bye, everybody.